And now let's finish off. Again, we slip the first stitch and here I'm knitting the next one. And to bind off, I take my left needle, grab the stitch that is right behind this first one on the right hook. So the next two are purl stitches. So I'm going to purl the next one. And then I'm going to reach over here and grab this one and pull it over the stitch. Okay, again, the purl. This next one now, bring it over. And there's your cast off. Now the next two are knit cast off. So do a knit stitch, reach over and pull this over the next stitch. Next knit, reach over and bring it over your knit stitch. Two more purl cast offs. You purl just as if you were continuing to work, but stop here and pull this one over the first one. Okay, one more purl cast off. Okay, pull this one over the first one. Two knit cast offs. One. And this one. Here's the next purl cast off. And I always recommend that you use the same stitch and pull it over. In other words, if you were knitting, you want to do the knit cast off, as I'm doing right here. And if you were purling, you would want to do your purl stitch and then pull it over. <clears throat> it just looks so much neater to continue your stitch as it should be. Here are the last two. Knit and knit. And just while we're right here, um, 